Welcome to Simple Software Tutorials. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Apple shortcuts to set the volume to zero or low setting when opening an app. Now, this is helpful to ensure that the volume is off or low when opening uh, an app that could be loud. Uh, so say, for instance, you're in the waiting room at the doctor's office and you want to scroll through Instagram or whatever. Um, this will ensure that your phone volume is very low uh, so you don't accidentally play a video loudly there. So I'm showing you the shortcuts uh, app in the App Store right now. So if you don't have it, that's where you find it. That's what it looks like. So I'm going to go ahead and open the shortcuts app. Now what we'll want to do, this is probably where you'll um, you'll end up when you open the app is on the shortcuts tab. And what we want to do is tap on automation down there in the bottom center. And here we can create a personal automation. So this is something that will just occur when we tell it to. So what we want to do is tap on that plus sign on the top right to create a new personal automation. And then from here you can either search in the search bar for apps uh, or just scroll on down until you find app. Now this is what we are looking for right here where it says app. So go ahead and tap on that. Now there's a couple things that I like to do just while I'm here. So first thing I want to do is make sure that is opened is selected. Uh, it was selected by default so I don't need to change anything there. And then down at the bottom where it says run after confirmation or run immediately, I want it to run immediately. Now if you want to get a notification when this runs, you can do so here by toggling that on, but I don't really need to know. As long as it happens in the background, uh, then that's great. I don't need a notification. So once everything here looks good, let's go ahead and tap on choose on, uh, on the top here next to app. So this is where we're going to choose which apps we want this to apply to. So you can either search up here, so say we want this to apply to Facebook, and then how about also Instagram? Now you can also just scroll through and find something in here, um, but searching works just as well. So once you've selected that, we're going to tap on done. So make sure things look good here. Uh, they should. And then we want to tap on next. So we've already said, hey, when one of these two apps opens, we're going to want to do something. So this next step, so let's tap on next. This next step is where we tell it what we want it to do. So what we're going to want to do is see under get started where it says new blank automation. We're going to want to tap on that. Now note that some instructions I've seen online tell you to just search for set volume. Y you can't find it here. So if you look for uh, volume, it's not going to pop up. Okay, so just know if, if you're reading online, that's what it says to do, but that's not necessarily how it works. So we want to tap on new blank automation. And then again here, we can search for actions or we can scroll through and use, uh, you know, any of these presets here. So you can tap on controls and under controls, you'll find set volume or just type volume into the search and you'll find volume but I'm going to go ahead and tap on set volume. And so all I need to change here is the percentage. So you can select from zero to 100. I'm going to tap on the 50 and I'm just going to slide that down to zero. Um, set it whatever is comfortable for you. Maybe you want it five or 10. Uh, it's just the volume percentage. And then I'm going to tap on done and tap on done again. And there it is. So I can tap on this to view it. And so just make sure that everything here looks good. Um, we want it to run immediately. I don't need to be notified when it runs. And so we can see when any of two apps are opened and I can tap on that to op open it, change anything I want to. Um, so when those apps are opened, it's going to set the volume to zero. And so that's all I have to do. So now when I open either of those apps, my phone volume will automatically drop down to uh, zero. 
So I hope this tutorial was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more helpful tutorials. Drop me a comment if you have any questions or any ideas, any anything that you, you think might be a helpful shortcut to have. I'm just kind of getting into them. Um, and have a great day. Thanks so much for tuning in.